briefly, Mr. Romo. Um, I'm uh, thinking that your project is uh, very uh, easily replicable uh, to other communities, uh, not only on the border, but in other continents and other situations. Have you made any efforts in that direction? Have other artists picked up on your model? Have you done anything in that regard? It seems to be very uh, positive. We're working in Guatemala. We have a very nice project there. We end up finding the situations are pretty similar, even though the landscapes are so different. Uh, people uh, are surrounded with trash and they, they face the same reality. So uh, now we're building a huge, uh, looks like a pyramid, a Mayan pyramid, but it's all made out of trash. And it's looking pretty nice because they were very creative and they're bringing other types of trash that I didn't use before. Uh, with that, uh, we just got an invitation to go to Africa to do something similar. I, I think uh, trash will become a commodity in the near future. Uh, we're gonna mine the landfills and the dump sites for materials so yes, I would love to expand that, and particularly into countries like this, where because we're so wasteful, and and we throw away so good things that we can just revalorize. Because it, it's this is beyond recycling. We need to revalorize what we're discarding. Thank you.